Hey there, this is Matt Burdell again, and I'm just finishing lunch, and I decided to take a little bit of a break because we just finished talking about um, much of the theory behind on-page uh, search engine optimization. So we're going to turn the pages a little bit, and we're going to start focusing on off-page SEO. Now, the importance of this is fairly obvious, that we need the search engines to find us if we're going to rank uh, in their index. So we're going to have our website here, and we've been kind of talking about this, and we have this nice website that we've done all this great on-page SEO. You know, we have a nice title tag, we have our H1 tags, we have good relevant content on the site. Um, everything is looking kind of good here, but now we need to tell the search engines, hey, here I am, come and start indexing me. Now this is going to be the, 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 the trick, and this is one of the things that a lot of people kind of forget, is that they think that just because you build it, they will come. This is not um, the, this is not that movie, you know, that it's not Field of Dreams. You know, if you build it, they will come. That's not necessarily the case. You need to kind of uh, jumpstart this a little bit. Now, um, one way to not really do this is to go out and pay for a service that submits to, you know, 10,000 search engines. Um, I have found that that's had absolutely no real impact on anything I've ever done. In, in the past, and in fact, most of the stuff that I do, I've never done that before, and I get great, great SEO. Going and telling a search engine that you're there doesn't really give them any cause to action to do anything, and I think it's kind of a pointless exercise. So I wouldn't go out and waste very much money or any money at all on submitting to search engines. So what I would do is I would start focusing a little bit more on getting people to link back to you because believe it or not, the, the, the internet is a popularity contest and, and the major search engines like Google and Yahoo and MSN and I'm going to kind of reference everything to Google now uh, because if you can rank for Google, Yahoo and MSN are going to follow and, ya and Google really still is the king of search engines and that's the one you really want to be in first and if you start um, getting indexed and getting ranked and getting traffic from Google you'll find that Yahoo and MSN will start following along just in the same way but what you got to realize though is that that again there's limited number of resources and there's a limited number of spaces for each term so Google needs to come and make the decision both on relevance as well as popularity because believe it or not if you do a search term like like we were talking about like, like the work at home or work from home you know there's 225 billion pages that could be relevant for that search term so now at that point Google needs to determine well what may, what is the most relevant page what's going to get the page one and once you're beyond page one and two, you're really not going to get any traffic. So your goal is to get in those first 20 positions, hopefully in that first 10 positions, and best of all, in that first position. That's your goal of the game. And what you need to do is you need to convince uh, Google that you're the coolest guy in town and the, and the information that you have is most relevant. We've already talked about relevancy here with the on-page um, on, with what we've done on page. The next step what we need to do is we need other websites linking back to our website, not only making them, um, making us relevant, telling Google like, like, yeah, that we're here. It gives us a way for Google to start finding us a lot better too because, you know, um, Google needs somebody to tell them that you're there and if multiple sites are telling them that there's a website over here that's yours, Google's going to start indexing you. And then the other way is, is that the, the, the uh, websites that are pointing towards your websites, the more authoritative those are and the more that Google indexes those, the faster and the more it's going to index your website too. So you not only want to get a lot of links pointing to your website, but you want that those websites to have a lot of links too. And you want it to be highly authoritative, highly indexed, and you know something that the Google spiders index theirs a lot too. So that's going to be our next goal in this part of the, the SEO lessons, is for us to focus in on getting links pointing back to our website. And it's more than just having them point to us, it's the way that they point to us too. We're going to talk about anchor text in the next video because it's one of the most important things that's involved with all of SEO. See you in the next video. You can watch all 10 SEO videos, including downloadable transcriptions for this entire training series right now for free by going to seoexciter.com.